Hi everyone, let's continue. Scopus list. I had already given you Scopus list uh, in the various videos, but this is the latest Scopus list. And here is, we can see in this list how many journals are Scopus indexed and how many journals are out of Scopus indexed. Now we can see, let's say we will talk about first, this one is the red one. ABB review. You can see here ABB review and this journal is inactive and discontinued by Scopus. Further, we can see this one is the, uh, this is the new journal, right? This is journal is also, it is not discontinued, but it is inactive. And here is academic journal of cancer research that is inactive and discontinued by Scopus. Further, we can see Academy of Marketing Studies journal that is inactive and discontinued by Scopus. So, uh, one more journal and rest of the journals, if the number of times our research scholars, they are facing this problem, whether um, how we can find out whether this particular journal is Scopus index or not. Now, you can see ACP Journal Club that is inactive, but it is not discontinued by Scopus. And uh, but that is inactive. So there is no need you are going to send your research papers in these kind of journals where those are inactive or those are discontinued. This one is the Acta Biochemica that is discontinued by Scopus. We can see. And uh, here is that is one more journal that is active. And here is a, this one is journal that is also discontinued by Scopus. So in that way, this is the list that is, uh, we can say, um, alphabetically arranged. And uh, you can see any name of the journal alphabetically. You can just find out, suppose, whatever is the journal name you would like to find out. You can just type in Control F, you can press. And after Control F, you can write your journal name. And this journal would be appear over here. And you can check status of that particular journal. Sometimes, because if the journal is inactive, so, and after that, after, after after some time it will become active so that would be as a that would not discontinue from the scope it depends upon number of the guidelines and the actual problem of economic this is also you can see discontinued by scopus and through this uh, print issn number you can see in this column and eissn number active or inactive status titles discontinued by scopus due to quality issue right due to quality issue because as I said, number of parameters are here. Those are not maintaining quality. These are discontinued by Scopus. Now you can see this is the coverage 2008 to 2016 only. After that, it is discontinued. Or <clears throat> article language and sources and 2017 site score, 18 site score, 19 site score. If you would like to see site score, you can see here. And uh, source type and title history indication further than when we will move on. And uh, related title of the title history indication as all. Publisher imprints group to main publisher and all you can see. And uh, all these things you can see in this Scopus index list. I would share this list in my description box. And uh, you can refer, you can, you can download this list also. And uh, you can check your uh, whether your uh, journal where you are targeting that is um, uh, Scopus index or not. So I hope uh, we can see total how many is a moment. I just want to show you this list is uh, you can see till Z. And uh, here is I'm just reflecting you. This one is the you can see 40,805. If we would exclude, let's say, first line, so 40,804 total journal list is here. And I'm sure this video would be helpful to find out the journal, whether it is a Scopus index or not. And that would be helpful for your future publication. Thank you so much. Keep watching and stay tuned.